Can the exciting South American aggressor Hector Saldivia emerge from the shadows tonight? The all-action 26-year-old is desperate to impress against decent southpaw Saeed Uwali. I work very hard for this uh, for my goal. I will go victorious with a victory to my country, Argentina. Whoever is in Argentina, I never heard of him. So I'm not no disrespect. I don't know who he is. I never seen a fight, but. Uh, I think it's going to be an interesting fight. Saldivia is ranked fourth by the WBA and is aiming to mix it with the world's elite welterweights. Welterweight is probably the most famous division. I believe that I will give everything to continue and fight the best, and I will fight the best. Uwali grew up in Belgium, but has long been based here in America under Roger Mayweather's guidance. The lively 30-year-olds won 26 times and is delighted to be showcased on this packed card. I gotta come out with a, with, a, with a big, big win. That's my most important thing. I'm ready for KO or to go the distance. Regardless, I will win. As a professional, 20. Decent way to start the evening. There's Owali RMC, Michael Buffer completing the introduction. Right in Las Vegas, Nevada. Said Owali. And his opponent across the ring, fighting out of the red corner. Wearing tiger stripes, official weight, 147 pounds. His professional record, 33 victories, including 26 knockouts. Only one defeat. He comes to us from Comodoro, Rivadivia, Chulabut, Argentina, Hector El Tigre, Saldivia. All right, trunks here are good. Anything below that is a foul. Trunks here are good. Anything below that is a foul. Gentlemen, we went over the rules in the dressing room. I want to remind you, I expect a clean fight. Cuadrasen, quiero una pelea limpia. Dios los bendigas. Token with guantes. God bless. Touch up. So a super stage for some of world boxing's most talented youngsters to experience tonight, even shine on maybe. And the latest hope and a good crop of current Argentinian fighters is Hector Saldivia, who kept telling us at the press conference that he has the type of style to really excite the fans. Tricky assignment, though, to fathom out the tall southpaw Saeed Uwali, who has real ambitions of his own. It's an interesting one to kick off with, and a shot very early, first 10 seconds, and down goes Uwali. There's Seven. a thumping punch that caught him Eight. in the forehead. He just Boxer. seems to have scrambled yes. his senses. He was yes. shaking his head as though he didn't quite know what happened. So see if he can get himself back together again. Flying fists, furiously, of Saldivia, who's on the brink of a dramatic first round victory. Huani in big trouble, right hand rocks him. He tries to fight back bravely, but he's in dire straits. Well, Sardinia is doing the right thing, get right on his opponent before his head is attempt to clear. Uwali still looks all at sea, doesn't quite know what's happening, his balance isn't right. So Sardinia can just take it to him and throw caution to the wind. Heavy right hands, 26 knockouts on the slate already, but down goes Sardinia! Uwali with a countering shot! Cover from that. His legs are completely gone. Well, is going to have to just take his time, keep his cool. Right hand back from Saldivia. This is a humdinger. Saldivia looks hurt again. Left down the pipe and a right hand. And Saldivia goes to the canvas. And his legs have betrayed him. And the fight is all over. A dramatic turnaround. In double quick time for Saeed Uwali, part of the Mayweather camp, and they will be absolutely delighted. What about that? Well, it looked a tremendous match on paper. Two big punchers, two winning fighters who had been facing winning fighters in their own career. Didn't expect it to go the distance, but didn't expect a shot like that. Tremendous.
full credit to Uali, the way he come back, he was almost out of the fight himself, finds himself on the floor, comes back up off the floor, scores two knockdowns, tremendous, what a way to kick off the evening. Thunderous action, and Hector Saldivia loses for the second time, having been on the verge of a massive win himself. Uwali, who grew up in Belgium and has been based in Vegas for a few years with a, a kiss and an embrace for, for Hector Saldivia. A power shootout. Saldivia didn't really recover from the first knockdown. You can see the state of his legs when they get back up again. He was all over the place. I'm sure the referee must have had a good look and thought should he be stopping it there. So one good clean punch was all it took, and that's Ladies what happened. Ladies and gentlemen, here at the MGM Grand, the end comes at 1 minute 47 seconds, round number one. He gets up off the deck to score a knockout victory from Las Vegas, Nevada. Said Huali! Well, a uh, dramatic way to start the evening. Three knockdowns in the first round of that one. Uh, is it a focus of what's going to happen the rest of the night? We'll get reaction from Johnny Nelson and from Glenn McCrory in a couple of moments' time as we build up to Shane Mosley against the flash, brash Floyd Money Mayweather. He's a man.